in this video you are going to solve for x and y given that x squared plus y squared is equal to 13 x minus y is equal to 5 so to do that we level these equations so from equation 2 we make x the subject of the formula so that we shall have x is equal to uh, 5 plus y and we call this equation 3 next we substitute equation 3 in equation 1 so that we shall have uh, instead of 5 we write x uh, plus y we square that plus y squared this is equal to 13 when you square this one, you will have 25 plus 10y plus y squared plus y squared is equal to 13. We can take 13 uh, to the... So y squared plus y squared will be 2y squared plus 10y plus 25 minus 13 is equal to 0. Taking 13 on the left hand side, so you shall have 2y squared plus 10y plus 25 minus 13 is 12, which is equal to 0. Then we, we divide this equation by 2. So y, 2y squared divided by 2 is y squared plus 10y divided by 2 is 5y uh, plus 12 divided by 2 is 6 which is equal to 0. Then this is a, a, a quadratic equation which we can solve it by factorizing. So you ask yourself what are the two numbers which when you multiply by when you multiply you obtain 6 and when you want you obtain uh, 5 so it is 3 and 2 so we write y squared plus 2y plus 3y plus 6 this is equal to 0 so we factorize the first two whereby we have y y plus 2 plus we factorize 3 in the last two numbers, so we shall be left with y plus 2 equals to 0. So y plus 2, y plus 2 is common, so we factorize so that we shall be left in the first pair with y plus, in the last pair, 3, which is equal to 0. So meaning that y plus 2 is equal to 0. Or y plus 3 is equal to 0, which implies that uh, y is equal to negative 2, or y is equal to negative uh, 3. We had written in our, in our equation up here that uh, in equation 3, we had obtained that. Uh, x is equal to 5 plus y so when when y is equal to negative 2 x will be equal to uh, 5 minus 2 which is equal to 3 when y is equal to negative 3 x will be equal to 5 minus 3 which is equal to 2 so the solution is uh, x is equal to 3 when y is equal to negative 2 or x is equal to 3 when y is equal to 
negative 2. Those are our uh, result. And of course, if you check here, you can clearly see that when x is equal to 3, 3 is equal to 5 minus 2, which is 3. When x is equal to 3, 3 is equal to 5 minus 2, which is 3. So those are, those are our, our result in that simple equation. For those who are new, kindly consider to subscribe to the channel uh, so that you don't miss a single video which I upload for us every day. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. See you in the next video as we keep on learning this important field of mathematics. Thanks for watching.